One win in the last five games and back-to-back -back defeats for Charlton means Alan Pardew is a less than happy manager, especially after losing star striker Sveteslav Todorov, who's now out for the season. Oh, it was a disappointing evening, a frustrating evening. Um, we lost uh, you know, a, a very good player on the night as well, which probably was the worst thing that happened. Um, the defeat you can accept. Uh, I thought Plymouth uh, were a good team. I think um, we was unlucky not to get something from the game. But having said that, um, you know, two defeats um, for us now uh, is too many. What's been the main problem for you, do you think? Well, I think the problem for us has been uh, capitalising on the chances, really. The Wolves game, we dominated uh, the first half and we should have been leading and uh, conceded a soft goal and that knocked us back. And since that moment, really, um, um, we haven't looked quite the same. Uh, although on Tuesday night, again, we had a very, very strong second half. So two halves have cost us uh, two games, the first half at Wolves and the first half against Plymouth. And it's that... It's that intensity at the start of the game uh, that we need to uh, do better at. Club captain Andy Reid is convinced, though, they can get right back on track. It's by no means a crisis. Uh, you know, we're still um, we're still kind of three points off third place and four points off uh, off second place. So you know, two two wins and, and you're right back up there. So we're, you know, we're we're disappointed that, that we've lost two games on the bounce and we'd be looking to put it right. But we're we're not panicking. There's there's plenty of games left. We know how tight the league is, and as I said, we know that on our day we're capable of beating anybody. They'll be hoping to do that on Saturday against QPR, a club that's had its fair share of problems this season, but under caretaker manager Mick Harford, they've gone three games unbeaten.